Imagine traveling from the bustling streets of Mumbai to the glittering skyline of Dubai in just two hours, all while gliding beneath the Arabian Sea. This isn't science fiction, but a bold vision that's captured the world's attention. Today, we look into the proposed Dubai-Mumbai underwater train project, separating fact from fiction and exploring the potential future of high-speed international travel. The concept of an underwater train connecting Dubai and Mumbai has been making waves since it was first proposed in 2018. This ambitious project, envisioned by the UAE national advisor Bureau Limited, aims to revolutionize transportation between these two major cities. At the heart of this proposal is a high-speed train that could travel at speeds of up to 1,000 km per hour potentially reducing the journey time from Mumbai to Dubai to a mere two hours. To put this into perspective, the current flight time between these cities is approximately four hours. The proposed rail link would span about 2,000 kilometers, with trains running through concrete tunnels constructed 20 to 30 meters below the surface of the Arabian Sea. This underwater marvel wouldn't just be for passengers, it's designed to facilitate the movement of goods, including oil and even water, potentially transforming trade routes in the region. One of the most intriguing aspects of this project is its potential to transport water from India's Namada River to the UAE, showing its multifaceted approach to addressing various needs. However, it's crucial to understand that this project is still in its conceptual stages. As of April 2025, discussions and feasibility studies are ongoing. While progress is being made, no official financial commitments have been announced, and approvals from various sectors are still pending. The technical challenges of such a project are immense, requiring billions of dollars in investment and cutting-edge engineering solutions. The proposed train would need to withstand extreme pressures and environmental conditions while maintaining incredibly high speeds. If approved and successfully implemented, this underwater rail link could be operational by 2030, potentially reshaping international travel and trade in the region. It would offer a competitive alternative to air travel, both for passengers and cargo transportation. As exciting as this concept is, it's important to approach it with a balanced perspective. While the UAE has a track record of turning ambitious projects into reality, an undertaking of this scale faces numerous hurdles, from technical feasibility to international cooperation and environmental considerations. Whether it becomes a reality or remains a fascinating concept, it has already sparked important conversations about the future of transportation and international connectivity.